Hello everyone, uh, welcome to this uh, Selenium Web Driver tutorial. In this tutorial, we will learn to upload the file using the Selenium Web Driver. So let's begin. First, let's understand how the upload functionality works, and then we will see how we can actually automate it using the Selenium Web Driver. For that, let's go to the browser here, and we need to search for Internet Heroku app. And this is a file upload option here but if we are going to the application directly just click on this one and then you will find this file upload option here just click on this one and here either if you click on this red box so it will open a pop-up or if you click on choose file it will open a pop-up in either case what we need to do is that we need to provide a file click upload then it will upload a file first uh, let's create a file and for that let me go here right click on this one go to new go to text document i'm naming it as selenium and let me open this file and let me type something this is selenium upload selenium web driver upload tutorial web driver upload file tutorial right and let me save this file okay now uh, we have this file and if I go back here and click on this one and let's select this selenium file click open you see that the file name is now appearing here selenium.txt now we need to click on upload it will upload the file and it will say file uploaded and this file is actually being uploaded now this is the functionality we need to automate using the Selenium Web Driver. Okay. Now let's uh, go to the Eclipse here, and in Eclipse, let's create a new Java file, and the class name. Let me name it as Automating File Upload. Okay. And let me select on this main method here and click on finish. Before we start automating this one, let me go to this previous script and let me copy some basics from here, basic code from here, so that we don't need to write it again and again. And here, first we need to do is that we need to provide this URL. So let me copy this URL from here and let me give it here, right? So we are done with the providing the URL. Now what we need to do, we need to identify this button or this, this particular box here. So let me go with this button, go here, click inspect and here if I go to select this hub so we can see that it has a unique id and the id is this one so let me copy this one from here and let me go here and we need to find this thing first so driver dot find element by dot id and id is this one which we copied from there and that's it now this particular button has been identified first what i will do is that i will save this into the web element okay web element let me name it as upload file right and here you see that it's showing some error so basically we need to import web element here right now once we have this file identified file button identified then we the easiest way to upload the file here is to use the send key method so let me copy this one and paste it here dot send keys and in the send keys we need to provide the complete url of that particular file so if i go to my desktop 
and this is a file right click on this file go to the properties so it's basically this one right format is dot txt and name is this one right so let me put this here so that i can create a complete uh, url or the path of the file from here let me do this and let me do now let's go here and the path is basically okay sorry it didn't copy the path let me go back here and let's rename let's go to the properties here and copy this one okay and go to the selenium here then we put double slash and the name of the file is selenium.txt right so selenium.txt here we need to ensure that we must provide the extension here okay now let's save this code and run this file and see what happens so let's run this and now without opening that dialog box it will provide the file and you see that the selenium.txt has been provided here without opening this one so that's a trick here that's uh, easiest way to you know send a file without opening the the file dialog box right and but it didn't upload in the file because we have to click on this upload button okay so let me inspect this one not from here let me go here and let me inspect this button and again this button has a unique id let me copy this one and let's close this browser from here and let's go to this script now driver dot find element by dot id and we will be providing id of upload button here and what we need we need to click on this one that's it okay now we are done with this code let's go here and run as java application and let's see what happens here it should upload the file and we will see this file uploaded page and that's correct so that's how actually you can automate the file upload functionality using the selenium web driver thank you so much for watching this tutorial if you like our content then do like comment share and subscribe our channel once again thank you so much and see you in the next tutorial